Hello everyone, in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to add push notifications onto your WordPress website. So the service I'll be using is called Push Crew, but there's quite a few out there that you can use, but uh, I'm just familiar with this one, so that's the one I'm gonna show you how to set up. Okay, so why would you need to use push notifications? So there are several reasons. One, let's say you are having a live show and you'd like to uh, let people know that you're just about to go live. You can use these push notifications. Or let's say you sell products on your website and you'd like to let people know there's a uh, flash sale. You can also um, use that to, uh, to notify your subscribers. And um, also, you can use these push notifications to um, promote a particular product, a sale, uh, and so on. Or even just letting people know that you have a new post or a new video out. Okay, so um, like I mentioned, I use uh, Push Crew. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to log into my account and then I can show you what's happening there. Okay, so I'm just going to click on Sign In. So as you can see here, uh, these are the total subscribers, 172. So these are people that came to my site and wanted to receive these push notifications. So sometimes you may think, oh, well, these are quite annoying. I don't want them and stuff like that. But if you have a website and uh, it uh, produces relevant information to your visitors, this is a good way to promote your products, what you do on your website and so on. Okay, so here you can actually go into uh, more detail and find out your reports. Like, for example, if I come here on reports, it tells you how many people have been subscribing on each particular day. So you can always go in and see uh, when, um, when your site was active. Again, you can also come here to uh, send notifications. So what you could actually do is you can actually push out notifications as if you were like sending out an email. So let's say there's something specific that you want to uh, push out there. You can just uh, craft your message and then just push it out uh, straight away. So that's how, how it works. Okay. And uh, you can also uh, schedule these notifications. So uh, this is where you can go ahead and sch schedule those. Uh, we also have triggered campaigns. Now, I haven't really set any of this up. I'm just using it basically to, um, so that when people come to my site, they can just um, uh, accept this uh, push notification. So uh, pretty much this is uh, the summary page uh, that shows you what is happening. So here I can tell that there is 155 on the desktop and uh, 88 on a mobile device. Okay, so now that we have all this in place, let's go ahead now and let's set it up. So over here on the settings, we also have uh, several ways to set this up. Uh, we have plugins. So uh, here we have a WordPress plugin. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here to my WordPress website. And uh, I'm going to come over here to plugins. Click on uh, add new. And then I'm going to uh, search for it. Okay, and we have it right here. Push crew, so I'm going to click on install now. Okay, I'm going to go ahead now and activate it. Right, so now that it's activated, I'm going to come over here to settings and then come to push crew. So this is where I need to add my push, push crew account ID. So I'm going to go back to my dashboard, click on account settings. And this is where my account ID is. So I'm just going to highlight this like that, copy it, and then I'm going to paste it right here like that. Click on Save Changes. Right, so now that all this is set, I'm going to go back to my um, Push Crew account, and then I'm going to come to Customize for Desktop. And then I'm going to make my customizations here. So this is the pop-up that comes up. And you can see here on uh, this mobile device, this is what it will show. So the message here can be customized. So at the moment, it says, want update notifications from Div University. And then it gives an option of either never or yes. So if they say yes, they'll be they will be subscribed. If you say no, then they won't uh, receive any notifications. And over here on the right, you also have uh, this... Uh, button which you can click to activate uh, those notifications. Now, here on the top, it says display push notifications uh, permission box after five seconds uh, on your website. You can customize this to even three seconds if you wanted to. So it's just up to you uh, how you prefer this. 
Okay, you can also upload your own logo because at the moment it's using the default push crew logo. And this is where you change your message. Okay, and um, over here on the bottom, you can also change uh, the colors to match your branding. Okay, so now that we have all this set, I am going to um, click on save. Okay, so that information is saved. So now I am going to uh, open my website in a new browser and then I am going to test and see if this is working now. So now if we take a look, we can see that our notification is now popped up. So this is the message that we had created. Click yes to get notifications in your browser. Get not notifications can be turned off at any time from browser settings. So this is the message that uh, the visitor uh, to your website sees and then they have, they have an option to either click never or yes. Okay, so thank you very much for watching and uh, please be sure to subscribe. And also, if you're new to WordPress, I have a free course which you can subscribe right away. The link to that is in the show notes below. Until next time, thanks for watching and see you soon.